Hey, it's Joachim. We're just going to look at using the push through bar on the tower for spinal mobility and playing around with different positions here. Feet are up against the uprights. So I've got one blue spring on and the arms are straight in line with the shoulders. A lot of people end up here. So you want to look at where the arms are in terms of where the spine is protracted or retracted. So we can look at extension here and going back into a neutral spine, extension into a neutral spine. What I love about the push through bar <clears throat> is that this is a closed chain exercise but the spring is still involved. It's a genius uh, design. Legs are straight. From here then we can go from a neutral spine to a lumbar curve, tilt of the pelvis. Neutral and tilt into extension. Bar hasn't even moved but the spine is going in all sorts of directions. So what I've got done about the start of the push through then with the straight arms, we can start from the tailbone, round the spine, flex forwards and bring the bar with us. All the way through, and then restack tailbone, rounding, pushing all the way back, and rippling back up into neutral. Or, which is harder, we can push from above, tucking the chin, trying to keep the pelvis stable, rolling through, restack. Find a neutral pelvis and then stack the spine on top of that. Much harder to know where you are in space. So really cool things to look at here. We either go from the tailbone and round through. Or we go from above and push through. Or we can do both at the same time. And that's before we even start to get into the more complex exercises around here. Push through bar is awesome. Thank you.